This is how the world I knew ended. By three, they come. By three, thy way opens. And a new one began. It started with Lilith and Inaris, the creators of Sanctuary. They each had their own twisted plans for humanity. Lilith, most of all. Salvation lies not in the light, but in you. Our only hope was a wanderer who'd been fed the demon's blood. This bond with Lilith was the key to unraveling her plans. Others joined the cause. I, Loras, was one of them. So was my old friend Donan and Nerel. I wish things had turned out differently for her. We learned that Lilith wanted more than to empower humanity. This key unlocks more than the doors of hell. It unlocks our path to the future. She aimed to devour her father, Mephisto, the Lord of Hatred. He was being reborn in hell. He is still weak, vulnerable. I must strike before he can resist. If Lilith succeeded, we'd all be damned. We had no choice but to follow her into hell. The angel Inarius and his Cathedral of Light were on the demon's trail too. An army of sheep led by a mad lion. The fool saw it as his destiny to kill Lilith. The heavens do not speak to you anymore. No! Through it all, there was another force tugging on the threads of fate. Mephisto himself. He had sent a herald to help the Wanderer hunt Lilith. Not for our benefit, but to save his own hide. Perhaps he was expecting us to join him. Your lives and those of all humanity depend on what you do next. Choose wisely. Nerel imprisoned Mephisto instead. Doing so also robbed Lilith of the power she so craved. I can't say what went through the demon's mind. Anger, yes, but was there more? Regret, sadness. With her last breath, she warned us of a dire future. Without me, you would have no victory. Nerel went off to extinguish Mephisto for good. Her heart was in the right place, but it was a terrible burden to bear alone. Lilith had been cast down, but our battle with Hell had just begun. Boy, young one, are you all right? <coughs> Nerel? Are oh, you not well? Please, 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 my child, let me help you. Stay away from me! Nerel! Is that how I raised you? No, mother. But... But I must carry this burden alone. I must get to Akarat's tomb. But look at you. You're killing yourself. I... I don't know how much longer... I can... Shh, shh, shh. I'm here. Little magpie. <laughs> I missed you so much. I'm so proud of you. But now I need you to give up. No, no, no. Of course 
it's you! <laughs> you must Let go of me! Let's go. No. You made a choice. And I warned you, little magpie. There would be consequences. Leave her be. She suffered enough already. I will tell you what you wish to know. It started last night with the tolling of the bells. Behold, the Reverend Mother Prova! And the burn night Yorivar! Soul survivors of the battle at Hell's Gate! Today we gather to witness the dawn of a new age. One made possible by the courage and sacrifice of our father Inaris. Yuravar and I have returned from the depths of hell, bearing his message along with the scars of our trials, to show that our devotion has not wavered. In hell, I was cleansed by battle and flame. Doubt and wickedness were burned away. But in the end, I was preserved. May all who serve the light do the same. This man is a mercenary, sworn to the service of the murderer, Lorath. He tried to hide the Horadrim girl, Nairel, from our judgment. A girl who threatens us all by carrying a fragment of the very same evil I battled in hell. Do you agree to repent of your sins and walk with us in the light? 
I do, I do. Bless you, Reverend Mother. Thank you, in the name of the Holy Father. I swear it. Release him. With all due respect, Reverend Mother, Father Inaris's mercy was great, but did he not also preach justice? Where then was the mercy for Yosef when Lorath slaughtered him? You ever are. What does it say about the cathedral if we allow such sins to go unpunished? Neither Lorath or the girl have been found. We have gained nothing. So tell me, is she owed mercy? Or is it justice? Justice! 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 No, 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 please! I, I, I told you everything! I, I, I repent it! No! You see, his sins were too great, too deep, and his faith was not strong enough to preserve him. Evil will no longer be tolerated in sanctuary, and we will show the heavens that we are worthy! I'll not have the faithful of Inarius shedding tears for a sinner. I won't say it twice. Where's your decency? Clear off! And you, your Prava's abandoned lapdog. Is that right? What a dismal, faithless existence. That's the problem with you and Horadrim. Such thinking always leads to hubris, and hubris leads to failure. Lorath's no stranger to it. Buried his own brother. Chased away the little one, that brat, Nairel. Only comfort left for him is at the bottom of a bottle. Tread carefully, wanderer. Judgment hungers for you both. And outside the city walls, not even our reverend mother will be able to stay its hand. That sick bastard has probably already sent his zealots after Laura. The old man better still be alive. of a known heretic. Deny me again, and you will join the condemned sin. I will ask only once more. What do you know of Lorath Nar? I know that he's a recluse and a drunk, but he's not the one burning people alive. Silver words from a sinner's tongue. You will atone!
Not ready yet. I'm out of vigor. I wish you'd arrived a moment sooner. No. Shin's broken. Legs are dead weight. Where is Lorath? Don't know. I, no one knows. Uh, third time I've come here looking for him. First time I got caught. Brought a message for the old man. We found Nairel. Nairel? Is she safe? A friend of mine is keeping an eye on her. The steelsmith, Raher. Biggest man in the Akul. He'll know where she's gone. Wanderer. So many courses. Always leading to you. And who is this? I am here to seek aid. Haradrim. Lorath. He was profane, yes, but reliable. I see he isn't here. Where is Nairel? As if I'd answer now. Leave, Prava. Your knights are dead already. No sense in joining them. My knights? How poorly do you think of me that I would beat a woman half to death? This was Urivar's doing, not mine. Who is Urivar? What do you know of him? He was just another man, Faith. Another knight marching through hell. Nameless, faceless. I never knew what he truly was. Until now, a repentant man prays for forgiveness. And Urivar burns him alive. There's no faith in such an act. No redemption. Only ego. You didn't stop him. No, I didn't. But he's begun a war for the Cathedral's heart. To save every life is to lose the war. I am not your enemy, Wanderer. Not when I gave you my blessing. Not when we shed blood together in the streets of Caldium. And not now. Your mind is poisoned against me, I see that. But in time, you will accept the truth. All those who serve the light must huddle together. Lest we die alone in the cold. It's no use talking to her. Just go. Find her a hair. I'll be fine. In line. You want in? You get checked for disease like everyone else. Back 
Back off, rat! There's no more room in the hall. Please! You have to bring him with you! I can't let him do it! Smithing fit for an iron wolf. Axes, armor, pots and pans. Lucky day, friend. You seem to have found him. I hope the cobbler didn't send you. Such a kind heart. Patched up her doorframe once. Now she sends every poor soul that needs a carpenter my way. <laughs> Only, that's not quite what I, uh... I'm here for Nairal. Ah, a friend of Lorath's then. Here, step into my workshop. Some things are best shared in privacy. And comfort. Hey, we have a guest. Yes, Papa. Come. Come, sit. I think better when I'm working. Uh, Fay, have you seen my... Uh... <laughs> this is my daughter, Fayira. We can speak freely here. Isn't that right? I understand you've word of Nairam. Yes, our friend Lorath was on her trail. But he left off. Didn't say why or where to. I saw her, though. She came through town a few weeks ago. How did she... Um, how did she seem? You needn't be so cautious. I know what she carries. I've seen what it has cost her. Last I saw, she went in search of passage across the river, into Nahantu. What? You just let her go off alone? You didn't even offer to help her? What is wrong with you? Hmm. Uh, could you fetch the set chisel for me, dear? Yes, Papa. Fahira is a foundling. Of circumstance, if not neglect. She and the welfare of this town are the responsibility I have taken onto my shoulders. Just as you, Lorath, and Narel have chosen to carry the burden of creation on yours, I will not trade one for another. Would you? I suppose not. You care too much, my friend. But that is a glad thing. <laughs> Whatever you need while you're on Geokul, I will be by your side. They've returned. Stay put, Faye. If trouble comes a-knocking... Then I go to the hideout, like you said. That's my girl. Yes, Lord, I said. But 
This isn't over yet. Come. Wretched things. Poor sludge and bone. We don't. The infection started in the Hantu. We can only stymie the flow. The Hantu? That's where you said nayrel has gone. I need to go after her. I know. And I promise we'll find her. Just as soon as Geyakul is safe. Only two gods? 
Where are the rest? They won't stop. Each kill brings two more. We're the only ones left. Calm yourself. We're going to finish this fight, and then drinks are on me. You hear? Understand. Go. See to your daughter. Thank you, my friend. We'll meet further down the road and find Narel together. I swear it. Narel was traveling by boat. The old bridge should have a good vantage of the river. of the cathedral. I can understand why Prava has tolerated you this long. But if the church is to survive, it must hold tight to its convictions. Either the rules apply to everyone, or they do not actually exist. That builds trust. The heretic Nairel has fled holy judgment. Wielding the very soul stone she stole from our brethren as they lay dying in hell. Girl. 
I see no reason to help you find her knight. How many lives will you trade to protect Meirel? Is her life worth more than his? <sighs> Mini, don't be such a cheese. Mini.